<laughs> Not primarily. I put it as my secondary. <laughs> It's fun though, isn't it? Oh, it's a great time. I did it in high school and uh, just doing it again at a higher level, it's definitely, I, I love it. Okay, when did when did, did they come to you with that idea? Did you go to them with that idea? And how long ago was that? Uh, I mean, I've always kind of been teasing them about it, how I've always done it a little bit, kind of just throwing it out there. And then uh, they eventually just kind of picked up on it and then it kind of just took off from there. What was the toughest hurdle you had to get over to convince them to put you out there? See, I honestly just worked hard on special teams. I feel like they saw me improving in special teams, and then they kind of just saw my film from high school, and it kind of just carried over. Is there, is there more than just blocking involved, uh, you know what I mean, down the road? I hope so. I mean, I'm, I don't really make the plays, but if I did, that's, I mean, I'd give it to me. <laughs> what's, what's the key to being good? Um, just having a hard nose and getting off the ball quick. I mean, how I kind of play defense is just wrecking, wrecking havoc in the offense. I kind of just flip it and kind of wreck havoc in the defense and kind of just make a hole for my running back behind me to get through. How does that work in practice? How often do you go over to the back and the side? Uh, I'm always switching from side to side. I mean, running back and forth and short yards and stuff, but it's fun. It's a great time. I love it. Do you have to it. know like twice as many plays now? Um, not really. I mean, uh, Coach Hinton helps me a lot with it, and uh, he sits me down with me, watch film with him. So, I mean, he definitely helps me through it. What's the mental process like? You know, you're, you're in the game as a defensive end, then all of a sudden you're called on to, to go over and play fullback on – the yeah, I feel like special teams really helped me out with that a lot. Kind of just doing the KOR and the kickoff, kind of just having that switch, flipping my switch. So, I mean, it kind of just goes with offense and defense, too. And what has come along on the defensive side for you? Where I mean, you're playing more, you know, yeah, I mean, in the just, real defense. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just hard work every day in practice and kind of just showing I have what it takes to be out there. And uh, eventually it was going to start paying off and uh, just kind of continuing that. And it's always having fresh guys. I feel like that's what Coach Jay likes, having fresh guys out there every couple snaps. So I feel like if we can just keep doing that and be always playing fast and strong. But did something kind of click with you too? I mean, on just making sure you're responsible on every play. I mean, did, did you feel something sort of come along like several uh, weeks ago? Yeah, I feel like you definitely just kind of what I focused on a lot this year is just doing my job. Because, I mean, if you do your job, there's no reason why not to be out there. And uh, that's all I focus on is just doing my job and making sure I do what I need to do to get the play done. There, there was a play that it looked like there's no way you were going to get involved in the play. I just stepped in the pocket. Mm. And then it was like, the relentless that you showed on that play. I don't know if it was like, what, what you yeah. Kind of walk me through your, your thought process on that play, or is it your thought process is on everything? Um, I mean, definitely. I mean, I'm not going to stop to the echo of the whistle's calls. I mean, I'm not going to finish the play. I mean, there's always something that can happen in a play to get you the chance to get, make the play. So, I mean, honestly, just continue my rush even though he steps up or moves away from me I mean I'm not going to stop until I get there or if somebody else gets there so I can celebrate with them oh yeah third time this year it's definitely <laughs> been a blessing to get all my family out there to come see me over there so it's definitely been a great time what's the posse like how I many people <laughs> this week we got a lot we got a lot like, like give me a general number about 15 or 16 yeah. Yeah, you did just say to the echo of the whistle, isn't that what you just said? Yeah, echo of the whistle. What does that mean? Just a little bit afterwards, you, just, you don't know if you hear somebody in the stand, you don't know what the whistle is, so yeah. I just kind of play through it. <laughs> so, potentially sloppy game, uh, Saturday grass, chance of rain, do you like that? Do you kind of brace? No, I love, whenever it rains out of practice, it's my favorite. I feel like it kind of just makes the vibe of a football vibe, kind of just getting grimy out there. I mean, I love it. Did uh, Purdue come after you hard, or what do you remember about the recruiting process? Um, yeah, I talked to uh, one of the coaches there a lot when I'm beginning of my recruiting, like my sophomore year of high school. So uh, kind of just talking to them a little bit. But uh, I've always, I was always a IU fan growing up, so I was never a Purdue fan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are, are there any offensive players who have particularly helped you with learning that pullback role? Um, offensive players? Yeah, I mean, the tight ends or any of them, and they helped you with uh, that. I mean, I watched a lot of Mitch Rossi film. I love watching Mitch. So uh, kind of just seeing what he did and how he had that mindset for it and uh, texting him a little bit definitely kind of helped me get my mindset ready for it, and it kind of helped me out a lot. Isn't it funny how Last they, they, they kind of refused to call a player a fullback? <laughs> this program. You know, I mean. They, this program was renowned for its fullbacks way back when. Mm -hmm. you know, so, but, what position are you playing? What, 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 if you had to tell somebody what you're doing on offense, what is it? Whatever they need me to do. That's what I say. Whatever they need. The whatever about. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you, you guys. Thanks.